something um, we did on the for the education opportunity program. One of the small smaller uh, pieces that we did, the North Star, an education opportunity program at New Post. And here's um, this is another this is a, this one of the same one. Well, then again, this is one of the same ones. And this is how it used to look. How, how it used to look years and years ago. We had, uh, also had Hermanos Latinos, you know. But um, the North Star used to look like this. But we're gonna we souped it up, and uh, this, is, this is the first time we had it. We had it. But we're gonna we souped it up, and we had a much smaller version now, eleven by seventeen, and uh, you, you'll see it in the moment. All right, this is, uh, I tried to tell Craig that this thing was upside down. Like, you know, like I don't know my dog on <laughs> kids, man. Okay, now let's go back. Let's go back to this. All right. This is uh, Bahari. This is the first Bahari that, you know, I worked on, you know. There was a brother named, this is me right there, but there's a brother named Papadopoulos. Uh, Charlton Davenport, who later did the cover to uh, Jazz Stories, Charlton Davenport. And uh, this is my first layout. You know, I was, I was a, a, a um, editor under uh, Papadopoulos, Charles Davenport. But this is the first one that I did for my first layout. He showed me little by little how to do this. He, he told me about, about uh, balance and proportion and different kinds of things, just weight and measurements really are actually in the layout in the layout process okay this is uh the first for hiring that i did the first for hiring that i did as as the editor stuff i had to feature my there's a picture of my daughter up in there saba but uh i featured you know just of course the continent the continent and of course uh what is this say we what we bring you the word right and it goes on and on all right this is the Pahari that was uh quite strange Charlton really really went off on it but uh you it's, it's actually it's it's a little tattered so I don't want to uh, do too much to it but uh it's just the pan it's the Black Panther over New Falls over New Falls this kind of thing over the college. This is Dr. Williams Myers. He was one of the college professors in the in Black Studies Department. He's a good man, good man. Very, very uh, esteemed gentleman. This is a piece when uh, our friend Bruce Claytor, you know, was uh, he was trying to get uh, a vice presidency on campus, on campus. And so it's like, turn it loose, turn it loose, vote for, uh, vote for Bruce. And see, he was our our, our co-editor at the Pahari, and so uh, we did this. Where did we where did we see this? At? Hold on. We did this for this particular piece. This particular thing. And see, and we just like you have a little menu. And, and see, somebody else already does. We, we did this before. We did this before, you know, this kind of thing. But uh, with, the, with those helicopters, you see, with those helicopters, you see, we, we did that. We did that, you see. We did that. You see? You see? You see? We did that. All right. And uh, this is... Uh, this is L. David Eaton, <laughs> my man. <laughs> yeah, this is him. This is him. Okay, this is him. And it goes on and on. You can see the different people in the faculty, the staff, so forth and so on. Uh, yeah, this is my little logo. The Bruce Calabresi, I remember him. We, we wanted him to um, to run for vice president. And this kind of thing. We had all races, colors. Religions, okay, and it goes on and on and on. Here we go. This is another Pahari that we did. 
this is this a young lady. I think her name was Melissa, I think. But uh, she was a young lady. And then some people thought, oh, he, it was being sexist because it looks like Playboy magazine. I said, no, that's Black Beauty. You, you didn't like it. That's Black Beauty. I mean, come that, on. That was one that was and produced of the yeah. Orange Jose. Yeah, and fools think they, that they, uh, that Black, that Black Beauty, they thought Black um, Beauty was a horse, you know? So, but this is another one, another Ferrari. This is, um, oh, the one with Dr. the late Dr. Margaret Wade. Yeah, this sister here. So that's another Ferrari. This is uh, this is Doctor Doctor Saeed Khatib. He was one of our studies, uh, our black studies uh, professors. This is uh, another Ferrari. This was quite controversial, you know, with the black man on the cross. <laughs> they didn't know what to do. Yeah. Okay, this is uh, the North Star. This is the one I talked to earlier. Like it was just this little nickel and dime looking thing, but we, we took it from, from this, we took it from this, you know, to, to, to this, to this, to that, you see, full-blown tabloid. Now this is one that I really, really like, this is um, Craig X and I worked on in college, this is called the College Voice, you know. And we had our little thing, take, take, uh, what, make, make my choice to college boys. <laughs> it was jamming, yeah. And uh, uh, Craig will, t Craig will uh, tell you a little bit about, about how we were working <laughs> all, all overnight. Just tell, why don't you tell us a bit about that? Oh, well, the newspaper production room was in the uh, basement of Boughton Hall. We get set up with new qu computer equipment, the first uh, version of Aldous Page Maker, and uh, <laughs> it was uh, uh, usually uh, produced overnight. So we'd start about ten o'clock at night and oh, go until about yeah. five six in the in the morning. Is oh, my recall. Right. Yeah, because you can yeah. you can you, you're clear. You know you don't have things yeah. on just clouding your, your your mind your consciousness. So you know I prefer late 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 at night because it's quiet and, and everybody else is asleep. But you just have to do your duty. You know. Yeah. Well, that was uh, that was a uh, marathon, really, with uh, Cool in the Gang. Yes, yes, and Shaw did. See, there's the North Star again. Okay, here. This is uh, my first poem uh, back coming back from New Orleans. Was from um, was it 1987 from um, from school, and um, I had to go through um, the, the the tropical, you know. The tropics in New Orleans is very, very uh, hot. I had to go through it, and uh, I had to find this editor and, and show show her my pieces. But she did it, you know. And she said, "Well, look, I'm I'm going to do these these poems, you know, about New Orleans." And um, here it is. Here, my name is New Orleans. It's the title poem to my collect one of my collections of poetry called "My Name Is New Orleans." My name, forty years of, of jazz. And for the years of jazz and other works. Okay, this is a long poem. And the people, they, 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 they loved it. The people loved it. You know, it's a classic piece. They, I, I shouldn't be saying that. But it's a classic piece. But these the people loved it. They, they, had, they didn't have anything like that. You know. Okay. 